Can you smell that? Fresh bread with pasta with cheese on it. I am seven. It's in the middle of the night. But while I'm sleeping, I can smell something. I can hear something. What could possibly be happening in the middle of the night? My older brother looks at me and he says, Amin, this is Sahur. You're a baby. You're not going to be fasting. At this point, my mom interrupts and she says, Amin, why don't we try doing a half day fast? I agree. You know, there's one defender that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala talks about in the Quran. There's a defender in the Quran? Asks Amin. Yes. His name is Nuh alayhi salam. He did what was right and stopped what was wrong. He protected Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's message no matter what, even though it was so tough for 950 years. Here's the thing. In life, every single day, you and I have decisions to make. There's the right decision and the wrong decision. And the right decision is almost always the more difficult decision to make. Do I hang up my clothes, throw them on the floor? Do my homework? Do I just waste a lot of time on screen time? Do you see this? The right decision can oftentimes be the more difficult decision to make. And fasting, Fasting during the month of Ramadan, when we see food and we decide not to eat it, it helps us build something called self-control. And because you know how we love Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and we love the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, and we, we strive to be the best that we can be in our Islam, well, I took that and I brought it to my sport. And so the fact that we have to pray five times a day, we have to, we're fasting, we have to stay away from food. I took all of those things, and when I played basketball, I thought about that and I said, if I want to be the best basketball player in my city, I have to practice hard. I have to have this focus and this discipline, just like I have in trying to be the best Muslim. I ate with my family that night and I went to sleep. I woke up the next morning like any other morning and I was excited for the day. I grabbed my Cocoa Puffs, I grabbed my skim milk, I poured the cereal in, I put in the milk and right as I was about to take a bite, my brother runs in and he's like, mm. And I almost forgot that I was fasting. I put the spoon down, I pushed away the cereal, I looked at the clock and I waited precisely until the whore time. And that is when I broke my fast.